The outbreak of the acute respiratory disease caused by the novel coronavirus has hit Vietnam's stock exchange over recent days as shares hit a three-year low. The market rallied on February 4, but investors remained anxious as the deadly virus claimed more lives. The sell-up in Vietnam's stock market continued for the third consecutive day on February 3rd, leading to the benchmark of VN index losing 4.7% 30 minutes after the opening to below 900, the lowest since the end of 2017. The stock market rallied on February 4th, with VN index being down 2.61 points at 925.53 in the morning section. Investors' psychology is strongly affected by the spread of NCOV epidemic, leading to the sell-off in the market. The Vietnam's top exchange was affected after the Asian markets have been hit hard amid lingering worries over the spread of the new coronavirus. Asian markets rallied on February 4, with Shanghai Bouncing Bank as bank and buyers stepped in after the previous day's rout. But trading flows remained anxious as China's deadly virus claimed more lives. World stock market fell sharply due to the effects of the new coronavirus. It has also created a panic in Vietnam's stock market. As of February 4, Vietnam reported 10 cases of NCOV infection. Schools in some 40 cities and provinces nationwide have been temporarily closed, while hold of festivals have been requested after the Prime Minister declared the 2019 NCOV an epidemic in Vietnam. The deadly virus originating from Wuhan has now spread 27 countries and territories worldwide, with more than 20,600 confirmed cases on February 4. It's hard to know whenever the disease will come to an end. This creates a considerable uncertainty among investors. Where the market plummets, I hope investors will calm down. In its latest report, securities firm VN Direct considered NCOV a black swan event which has a major impact on short term but is unlikely to change a full economic cycle. After strong fluctuations, Vietnam's stock market has showed signs of stability, with stocks being no longer sold strongly. However, the cautious psychology of investors, both sellers and buyers, led to low cash flow into the market.